It's a bummer, to be honest. It's a bummer to feel like people don't get something that you're doing and that you've worked so hard on. But ultimately, it's usually been the other way around, especially with Dear White People coming out of Sundance, where critics love Dear White People and audiences eventually loved it. But at first, it was incredibly polarizing. I don't typically read my own reviews. I learned that lesson a while ago, especially when they're good. But on this one, I read a couple of them and it, it felt like, I don't know, I wasn't quite sure what movie they were talking about all the time. It felt like there were some other things going on in those reviews, I got to say, than just what was happening in the movie. And that kind of thing is just out of your control. I think if anything, it was actually a really great lesson as a filmmaker in terms of like who you make your movies for and why you make them and what your sort of own marker for success is. I'd would rather have the audience go on the journey I want them to go on than anything. So I don't know. The rest is you just kind of take it as you get it.